Ashley Vasquez. Ashley. Amen. God bless you. And Jesus Morales, who's here with Milagros Vega. That's Maria's parents. God bless you guys. So everyone just extend your hands toward the visitors. And let's pray a blessing over them. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God, for every person that's here today. For we're here today to bless your name and to lift you up. And we're also here today to be edified, to be encouraged, to be brought closer to you and to one another. So, Lord, I pray for every visitor that's here, that you would touch their heart with a special word directly, directed specifically to them, oh God. I pray that you would prepare their hearts to receive that word and give them understanding of that word. And may that word grow and multiply not only to them but to the generation generations after them. I pray that you would use them to bring their whole family to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ. I pray, O oh Lord, that you would turn their hearts toward you, toward the cross. O oh God, I pray that you would open up their eyes and their ears and their hearts to you this morning, Lord Jesus, that they might know the awesome, awesome joy of serving you, of loving you, and of growing in the grace and knowledge of Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, protect them all of their days, and may none of the plans of the enemy come to pass in their life, O oh God, in your holy name. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Bendito sea el nombre del Señor. Aleluya. Gloria a Dios. Because today is Children's Day. Como hoy es el día de los niños. And they will be. Amen. Amen. And they will be coming up in a, in a, in a little while to present the program they have for today. En un corto tiempo van a venir a presentar lo que tienen para el Señor hoy. We like to proceed immediately to the Word of God first. Queremos proceder inmediatamente para la palabra de Dios. Because above all things, the Word of God must be proclaimed. Porque sobre todas las cosas la palabra de Dios tiene que ser proclamada. So, Amen, Church. Amen, Iglesia. So as we remain standing, I'm going to ask you to open your Bibles to Hebrews 12:14. Mientras que permanecen de pie, les voy a pedir que abran sus Biblias a Hebreos 12:14. And as, as has been said, welcome to all our visitors. Como se ha dicho antes, uh, bienvenidos a todas las visitas. And welcome to all our members as well. Y bienvenidos a todos los miembros también. Glory to God. Today after service I'll be I'll be sharing the word at, a, at another congregation. Hoy después del servicio voy a compartir la palabra en otra congregación. Freedom Assembly in Pelham, Pastor David Rivera, a friend of mine. Esa iglesia que él mencionó. So I I covered your prayers that after 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 service, not not Así now. Así que oro, pido sus oraciones después del servicio, no ahora. Uh, no, you guys are my priority. Ustedes ahora son mi prioridad. Always will be by God's grace. Siempre lo serán por, por la gracia de Amen. Dios. But let's go right to the word. Hebrews 12, 14. Entremos a la palabra Hebreos 12, 14. And as is we are accustomed, let us read it in English and then in Spanish. Como es nuestra costumbre, leeremos en, en inglés y luego en español. The word of the Lord says. La palabra del Señor dice así. English. English. Pursue peace with all without which no one will see the Lord. En español, por favor. Seguir la paz con todos y la santidad sin la cual nadie verá al Señor. Holy Father, we need your grace and the ministry of your blessed spirit to open our minds and hearts to receive your word. Lord God, give us this day our daily bread. May the word come forth to, for salvation of those who don't know you, for the restoration of those who have backslidden from you, Lord, and for the edification, encouragement, and comfort of all your people who are gathered here today and who will watch this on the internet as well. May your word go forth with power, for we ask it through Jesus Christ our Lord. And those who agree, will you say amen? No acuerdo, dice, amen. Thank you. Please be seated, everyone. Pueden sentarse. The verse you see behind me on the wall El versículo que me entras de mí en la pared has, is so short, es tan corto, but it's so powerful. Pero es tan poderoso. It was quoted incorrectly when I was growing up, fue citado incorrecta, incorrectamente cuando yo estaba creciendo. And there is a danger in misquoting the scriptures. Hay un peligro en mal citar las escrituras. Because the apostle Peter under the inspiration of the Holy Spirit warns us. El apóstol Pedro en la bajo inspiración del Espíritu Santo nos nos advierte. That if the word of God is misquoted in any way twisted que si la palabra de Dios es mal citada en alguna manera o, tor o torcida if it's not properly spoken and properly understood and applied si no está um, hablada apropiadamente o, eh, y, y aplicada entendida y aplicada it can cause great damage 
puede causar gran daño. And Peter says very clearly that that, that kind of attitude towards scripture y Pablo dice bien claramente que ese tipo de actitud hacia las escrituras has led to the perdition he uses the word perdition of many ha causado la perdición usa la palabra la perdición de muchos I have a perfect example of that in my life tengo un ejemplo perfecto en eso en mi vida and many people I am sure could bear witness of the same thing in their lives y estoy seguro que muchas otras personas pueden ser testigos de esto en, en sus vidas because the leaders that I grew up under back in the day when I was in my teenage years porque los líderes bajo los cuales yo crecí cuando, en los días de, de mi adolescencia whose intentions I do not doubt were good cuyas intenciones aunque no dudo que sean eran buenas they were doing what they felt was the best to protect us and to keep us safe as we grew up in Christ estaban haciendo lo que en su en en lo, en su opinión era lo mejor para protegernos y mantenernos uh, fieles en Cristo but unfortunately in in doing that they misquoted this verse you see behind me pero desafortunadamente en hacer eso ellos mal citaron este este versículo tras de mí and the damage has been incalculable. Y el, y el, y el daño que, ha sido, que han hecho ha sido incalculable. Our goal this morning. Nuestra meta esta mañana. And in the following Sundays, by God's grace. Y en los domingos por venir, por la gracia de Dios. Will be to, as we have done this morning, first of all, quote it correctly. Eh, va a ser, eh, como, como hicimos esta mañana en primer lugar, eh, citarlo correctamente. Understand it correctly. Entenderlo correctamente. And then apply it to our lives. Y luego aplicarlo a nuestras vidas. As individuals. Como individuos. As families. Como familias. And as a congregation. Y como congregación. So that we can reap the blessings that are in the word of God. Para que podamos cosechar las bendiciones que están en la palabra de Dios. Because God said that he sends his word with a purpose. Porque Dios dice que él envió su palabra con un propósito. And that purpose is always for our good. Y ese propósito es siempre para nuestro bien. How many receive that as being a fact? ¿Cuántos reciben eso como que es un factor? He does it for our good. Porque él lo hace para nuestro bien. So when I was growing up, they never quoted it this way. Cuando yo crecía, nunca lo citaron de esta manera. They would say it, and because I was raised in a Spanish church, this is how they would say it. Y lo decían como me, yo me, me crié en una iglesia eh, eh, latina, o España, de que habla España, española, español, español. <laughs> exactamente. Something's gonna work. That's right, exactamente. <laughs> decían así. <laughs> they would always tell us. Siempre nos decían. Sin santidad. Nadie verá al Señor. Without holiness, no one will see the Lord. And that's it. Y eso era todo. And you can hear it to this very day in many sermons. Y lo pueden oír hasta el día de hoy en varias varios sermones. And if you listen carefully, it sounds good. Y si escuchan cuidadosamente, suena bien. But look at the whole verse. Pero miren el versículo completo. The first thing it says. Lo primero que dice. Is to pursue peace. Es que que sigamos la paz. With everyone. Con todos. That was completely edited out. Eso completamente lo 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 editaron como que no no estaba ahí. And the fruit of that. Y el fruto de esto. Is you have many churches, Spanish and otherwise. Tiene muchas iglesias en de habla hispana y otros. Where there are people who believe that they are living holy lives. Donde hay personas que creen que están viviendo vidas santas. Because they dress in certain fashions. Porque se visten de cierta manera. Because they don't do certain activities. Porque no hacen ciertas actividades. And because of that, they have actually in begun to become what the Bible calls self-righteous. Y por esto se han hecho como dice este o la Biblia dice que son no son auto son muy justos, se justifican a sí mismos. Exactamente, arrogantes. But when you address it with them, pero cuando ustedes le, le habla de esto con ellos, and you look at their lives, y usted mira sus vidas, so many times you have believers who are not at peace with others. Tantas veces tenemos creyentes que no están en paz con otros. And the first thing I want you to see about this verse is that before you can talk about holiness, y lo, lo primero que quiero que vean de este versículo es que antes usted puede hablar de la santidad, which we will define, de la cual vamos a hablar, and explain with the grace of the, of the Spirit of the Lord, y explicaremos con la gracia del Espíritu del Señor. The first thing God calls you to do. Lo primero que Dios le llama a hacer. If you are a follower of Jesus Christ. Si usted es seguidor de Jesucristo. Is to be at peace. Es estar con paz. With everyone. Con todos. This is the word of the Lord. Esa es la palabra del Señor. And 
P Paul says something very similar. Y Pablo dice algo muy similar. In that famous verse that I am forever quoting. Y en ese versículo famoso que yo siempre estoy citando. Besides the sun going down. Aparte de lo de, de lo del sol. The verse that says in clearly in Ephesians chapter 4. En el versículo que es incluido en el capítulo en el 4 de, de Efesios. That it is our responsibility as followers of Jesus Christ. Que es nuestra responsabilidad como seguidores de Jesucristo. To preserve el preservar the unity of the spirit el vínculo del espíritu now get get that get that first part right la, la unidad del espíritu the holy spirit has made all of us one body el espíritu santo nos ha hecho a todos un cuerpo there is one body the bible says and there is one head of that body the lord jesus christ hay un cuerpo y hay una cabeza ese cuerpo que es nuestro señor jesucristo as you learned in your baptism and church and the church government and discipleship classes cuando como aprendimos en las en las clases de bautismo y when a person comes to Christ Cristo, among the many blessings they receive entre las bendiciones que reciben, they are baptized by the Holy Spirit immediately into the body of Christ. Son bautizados por el Espíritu Santo inmediatamente dentro del cuerpo de Cristo. So there is a unity that has been created by the Holy Spirit. Así es que hay una unidad que ha sido creada por el Espíritu Santo. You can walk in the street and you can sense when you're near a fellow brother or sister in Christ. Usted puede caminar por la calle usted puede sentir cuando está cerca de un otro creyente en Jesucristo not always because of what they're dressing or how they're talking y no siempre por lo que están vistiendo lo que dicen sometimes you can just feel it a veces usted puede simplemente sentirlo you sense I, that's someone that knows Christ es una persona que conoce a Cristo has anyone ever had that experience before a usted ha tenido esa experiencia anteriormente of course we do claro que sí because the Holy Spirit created that unity porque el Espíritu Santo creó esa unidad whatever the condition of the church is politically cualquiera que sea la condición de la iglesia políticamente so many denominations tantas denominaciones so many different groups and things going on tantos diferentes grupos y cosas pasando beyond all of those human man-made distinctions más allá de todas esas distinciones hechas por por seres humanos Presbyterian, Pentecostal, Episcopal, lo que sea beyond all of that más que todo esto at the heart of it all al corazón de todo there is a unity that the spirit of god has given as a free gift hay un, una unidad que el espíritu santo ha dado por un como un don gratuito to every person has given their heart to jesus christ a cada persona que ha dado su corazón a jesucristo you're part of a large family son parte de una una gran familia. Let me fix that. You're part of an immense family. Usted es parte de un parte de una iglesia de una familia inmensa. You know how immense that family is? Sé cuán inmensa es esta familia. The Bible says the family of God exists on earth and in heaven. Dice la palabra que la familia de Dios existe en el cielo y en la tierra. We're talking millions and millions, and I think by this point up to billions of people throughout history. Estamos hablando de millones y millones, yo creo que hasta billones de personas a través de la historia. To this very day. Hasta ese día de hoy. And into the future. Y en el futuro. We are all one body. Somos todos un cuerpo. The Holy Spirit made that happen. El Espíritu Santo hizo que eso ocurriera. And we give God thanks for that. Denle gracias a Dios por esto. No one. Nadie. That's in Christ is alone. Que está en Cristo está solo. There is an organic unity among us all. A la unidad orgánica entre nosotros. Todos. I know, I know that so many Christians and so many places have the same complaint. Yo sé que hay muchos cristianos en tantos lugares que tienen la misma querella. And they always say the church is not united. Dice que muchos dicen que la, la iglesia no está unida. And let's pray for unity. Oremos por unidad. You're not going to get an answer to that prayer. No va a recibir una respuesta a esa oración. James says you have not because you ask wrong. Santiago dice no tenéis porque piden no no sabéis pedir. Whenever you pray, Lord, grant unity to your church, you are flying in the face of the declaration of the scriptures. Cuando usted ora, Señor, otorga la unidad a la iglesia, usted está haciéndole mal a lo, a lo que dice la escritura. Because God said the church is already united. Porque dice la palabra, Dios dice que la, la, la iglesia ya está unida. In our spirit, we are one body. En nuestro espíritu somos un cuerpo. When, when, when the finger suffers, the rest of the arm suffers. Cuando un dedo sufre, el resto del brazo sufre. One member suffers, the Bible says, and all the members suffer with it. Un miembro sufre, dice ella, que todos los miembros sufren con él. That unity is there. Esa unidad 
humanidad está ahí. It exists. Existe. You didn't make it. I didn't make it. Usted no lo hizo. No lo hizo. No lo hizo. The yo. Holy Spirit made it. El Espíritu Santo lo hizo. So you're not alone. Así que usted no está solo. No matter how you may feel today. No importa cómo esté hoy. You are never, ever, ever alone. Usted nunca, nunca está solo. You're part of a family that spans eternity. Usted es parte de una familia que va por la eternidad. Now, though the unity cannot be destroyed. Que y aunque la unidad no puede ser destruida. Because the body of Christ will not be torn apart. Porque el cuerpo de Cristo no va a ser no no va a ser eh, de, dividida. But the unity can be damaged. Pero la unidad puede ser dañada. Puede It's ser very dañada. similar to what can happen to my to our bodies. Similarmente como no, no, le puede ocurrir a nuestro cuerpo. When I was a little a younger child, a younger boy, I was about maybe 11 years old. Cuando yo era un chico de 11 años más o menos. I was very heavy. Yo, yo era bien bien pesado. You know how Puerto Rican and most Hispanics think. Ustedes saben cómo cómo piensan los 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 hispanos la mayoría. Los mayormente. boricos y todos los hispanos igual, all of them I think. You know, the fatter you are, the the, the better you look. Lo lo más lo lo más grueso que es. Lo oh mejor come se on, ve. you know it's true. Ustedes saben que es verdad. Come, come, que te estás muy flaco. You know how they are. Eat, eat, you're too skinny. Hasn't anyone gone through that here besides me? No ha pasado nadie por eso aparte de de mí. Visit your family and get ready to be stuffed like a, like, a, like a roast pig. You're like, sí. oh, no puedo más. Come, ¿qué es esto? ¿Qué pasa contigo? You know, Look, the usual. Those, those bones. <laughs> so I was raised that way. Yes, yo siempre estaba así. Someday I'll tell you the kind of breakfast I had every morning. You, you wouldn't believe it. Le digo el desayuno que tenía todos los días, no lo creería. And I would, I would eat and eat and eat, and so I was heavy. What can I do? Yo comía, comía, comía. Claro, estaba, estaba muy, 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 muy pesado. And I, and I was running with my cousins one day. Un día estaba corriendo con mis primos. Good old fat Ray was running down the street. <laughs> y, y <todo. laughs> you know? Corriendo por la calle. I was. Estaba grabado con eso. Estaba gordito yo. Estaba cebado. Estaba yo cebadito. Right? <laughs> And I remember I tripped on, 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 on a rock or something, whatever it was. And with my right foot, I landed. Y con mi, mi pie derecho, aterricé. And all that weight went down on my right, on my right ankle. Y todo ese peso cayó sobre mi tobillo derecho. I was taken to the hospital, of course, because I couldn't walk. Me llevaron al hospital porque no podía caminar. They told me it's almost broken, almost. Me dijeron ya está casi uh, roto. But all partido. you did was stretch the tendons. Lo único que hiciste que fue estirarse los tendones. And therefore, it got really inflated. It got really big. Y por eso se inflamó y se puso muy grande. And it really hurt to walk on it. Y, y dolía mucho caminar en él. You see, my foot wasn't torn off my body. Mi pie no estaba no, no estaba arrancado de mi cuerpo. But it was strained. Pero sí estaba mal herido. It was, it was damaged. Estaba da dañado. Because I wasn't careful. Porque no fui cuidadoso. I had a big body and I was running like a nut. So estaba, it happened. un cuerpo muy grande y estaba corriendo como un loco. And that's why the Bible tells us. Por eso es que la Biblia nos dice. That despite the fact that there is a unity of the Spirit. De que aparte, que a pesar del hecho de que hay una unidad del Espíritu. The rest of it is a warning. El, re el resto es una, una advertencia. It says, be, be diligent to preserve. Sé diligente a prese, para preservar esa unidad. So there is something we must do Así que sí, hay algo que nosotros tenemos que hacer to maintain the unity. para mantener esa unidad. And when we do not do it, y cuando no lo hacemos, we stretch the spiritual tendons of the body of Christ. Entonces e, e, estrechamos, estiramos los tendones espirituales del the cuerpo de Cristo. The body of Christ becomes sprained. El, entonces el, el cuerpo de Cristo se está entonces herido. It gets hurt. Se, está herido. It gets damaged. Eh, se, está dañado. You're no longer able to walk on the foot because it has been strained. Entonces ya no podemos andar sobre el pie porque ya es, es, ha sido ha tenido ha recibido daño. You can't use the arm because you strained the sinew or a tendon. No no puedo usar el brazo porque entonces ha, 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 le ha hecho daño a los tendones. And what is it that can hurt the body of Christ? Y qué es lo que puede herir el cuerpo de Cristo? We have the answer in Ephesians and we have the answer here. Tenemos la respuesta en Efesios y tenemos la respuesta aquí. Because Because in Ephesians it says, be, be careful to preserve the unity of the Spirit. Porque en Efesios dice que tengáis, eh, eh, tengáis cuidado de preservar la unidad del Espíritu. In the bond, and there's the key word, en el vínculo. En el vínculo. In the bond. En el vínculo. Of peace. De la paz. What keeps us together. Lo que nos mantiene junto, unidos. In a, in a healthy. En, 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 In a healthy and functional way. En una manera saludable y funcional. What keeps the body running smoothly and properly. Lo que lo que mantiene que el cuerpo esté corriendo muy bien y apropiadamente. Is peace. Es la paz. 
the minute peace is gone. En el momento en que la paz es la ida, the body suffers. El cuerpo sufre. So here in Hebrews, Así que aquí en Hebreos, right in line with Ephesians, exactly the same teaching, we are told that we are to pursue peace. Se nos dice que tenemos que seguir la paz. Now when we're told to pursue something, nos dice que, que, que persigamos algo, the picture is of something that is eluding us. El, el, el cuadro es algo que nos, que nos está um, evadiendo. evadiendo. Something that we, we can easily lose if we're not careful. Algo que podemos perder fácilmente si no somos cuidadosos. It's almost like it's running away from us. Es como que está huyendo de nosotros. And you have to chase it. Y tiene que seguir. Pursue tiene que, it. Tiene que perseguir o tiene que seguir tras de ello. Why is that? ¿Por qué es esto? It's because everyone here falls under the same condition that the Apostle Paul says. Es porque todos aquí ba caen bajo la misma condición la cual describe el apóstol Pablo. Some of us more, some of us less, but all of us are guilty of this. Algunos más, otros menos, pero todos somos culpables de esto. Because of the presence of the sin nature that we still have dealing with inside our body. Por hecho de la presencia de naturaleza de pecado que todavía está en nuestros cuerpos. That wants to do what's best for me. Que quiere hacer lo que es mejor para mí. Like yours wants you to do what's best for you. El suyo quiere hacer lo que es mejor para usted. It's what Isaiah and Isaiah 53 warned us about. Y es lo que Isaías 53 nos nos advierte. He said everyone has gone their own way. Dice que todos han ido por su propio camino. And the apostle Paul echoes that. Y el apóstol Pablo hace un eco a esto. When he says all seek what is best for themselves. Todos buscan lo que es bueno para sí mismos. Not what's in the best interest of Jesus Christ. No lo que es el mejor interés para Cristo. That is an incredible accusation. Esta es una acusación, una acusación increíble. And, and, and thankfully it's found in the context of an exception. Y gracias a Dios se encuentra en un contexto de una excepción. Because Paul was praising Timothy. Porque Pablo estaba alabando a Timoteo. And saying how Timothy was interested in the things of God above the things of his own life. Y diciendo cómo Timoteo estaba más interesado en las cosas de Dios más que de las cosas de este mundo. And that's why Paul says, I have no one like him. Y por eso Pablo dice, no tengo nadie como él. Because everyone seeks their own. Porque todos buscan para sí mismos. Not the things of Jesus Christ. No las cosas de Jesucristo. But he is different. Pero él es diferente. Thanks be to God, we can be different. Es, nosotros podemos hacer, gracias a Dios, diferentes. There is hope. Hay esperanza. We don't have to be like the crowd. No tenemos que ser como el grupo. But be aware that the crowd of Christians everywhere in the world pero esté al tanto que el grupo de cristianos en todo lugar del mundo danger, sea por falta de entendimiento de este peligro way, o por escoger por voluntad propia de ser así own, buscan lo, su lo, lo, lo suyo you own, y cuando usted busca solamente lo suyo in search, si alguien in interfiere en esa búsqueda Va a haber tensión. There will be conflict. Va a haber conflicto. And the minute we are in conflict, I don't care what the reason is. Y el momento en que estamos en conflicto, no importa cuál sea la razón. You could be saying, I have a zeal for God, and you act in a carnal way. Usted puede decir, yo tengo un celo para Dios, y, hasta, y, y, se, y se comporta de manera carnal. The Pharisees did that. Los fariseos hicieron esto. They had a zeal for God. Tenían un celo por Dios. Look how they demonstrated it. Y, el, Mira, mira cómo lo y lo, lo molestaron muy, muy, muy orgullosamente. Jesus condemned them for how they demonstrated their zeal for God. Jesús los condenó por la manera en que demostraron su celo por Dios. So we have to be careful because in our zeal we can lose our peace. Tenemos que tener cuidado porque en nuestro celo podemos perder nuestra paz. And if we are in conflict with anyone, hear me, brothers and sisters, with all my heart, I implore you, y, hear me. Y cuando estamos en conflicto con cualquier persona y escucha, mi hermano, les imploro. Do not turn a deaf ear. No tornen oído o uh, sordo. And do not let your human mind come up with a thousand justifications right now. Y no permita que su mente humana venga con diferentes o con miles de justificaciones Because ahora. Because the power of sin, though it is broken, porque el poder del pecado, a pesar de que está roto, it is still very much alive. Todavía está muy vivo. And it's still in our brains. Y todavía está en nuestras mentes. Which is why the Bible tells us we must bring our thoughts captive. Por eso que ahí nos dice que tenemos que tener nuestros, nuestros pensamientos cautivos. The picture is of you going after your thoughts and putting them in prison. 
el, el cuadro ese usted va, va y busca sus, a sus uh, pensamientos y los pone como en una prisión and bringing them in chains y los trae en cadenas unto the obedience of Jesus Christ a la obediencia de Jesucristo so hear me when I tell you this óigame cuando digo esto that it does not matter what reason you want to give why you are in conflict with someone que no importa qué razón usted quiera dar cuando esté en conflicto con alguien the Bible says as far as it lies within you y se aparta que en cuanto se viene a estar dentro de usted you can't control other people's feelings, usted no puede controlar la, lo, los sentimientos de otras personas but as far, Romans 12, as far as it lies within you, pero Romanos 12 dice que, con, que en, en cuanto se viene cuando está parte de, su, de parte suya be at peace. esté en paz be at peace esté en paz with everyone con todos and by the way that word peace y, y esa palabra paz does not simply mean a lack of tension no simplemente quiere decir una falta de tensión. There are many strangers out there in the world that I haven't met yet. Hay muchos extraños allá en, en, en el mundo que no he conocido. Likewise you. Al igual ustedes. When you travel in the train tomorrow morning. Cuando usted se va en el, en el tren por la mañana o en el bus You're donde quiera. surrounded by strangers. Está rodeado por personas que usted no conoce. Are you at peace with those strangers? Está en paz con ellos? In a sense. En un sentido. You're not fighting with them. No estamos peleando con ellos. You don't even know them. Usted lo conoce. In fact, you have no relationship with those strangers. Usted no tiene relación ninguna con esos extraños. There is nothing there. Usted no conoce. That is not the peace the Bible speaks of. Esa no es la paz de la cual habla la Biblia. That's easy. Eso es fácil. I don't know them. I don't talk to them, so we have no problems. Yo no los conozco, no les hablo, así que no tenemos ningún problema. The peace the Bible speaks of. La paz de la cual habla la Biblia. The wonderful Hebrew word shalom. La palabra maravillosa hebrea shalom. Translated into the Greek as Irene. Yeah, I got a lady's name, Irene. Irene means peace. Uh, Traducida en el griego a, como Irene, que quiere decir, o Irene, que quiere Irene. decir paz. If you know any Irene, tell her peace. That's her name. Quiere decir paz. Right? Usted dice Irene, está diciendo but paz. The, but the root of those, that word. Pero la, la raíz de esa palabra. Has with it the meaning. Tiene dentro de sí el significado of a harmonious relationship de una relación armoniosa mutually beneficial to both parties. mutualmente beneficiosa para ambos lados. For example, Por ejemplo, how many here are at peace with God? ¿cuántos aquí están en paz con Dios? The Bible says, therefore being justified by faith. Dice la palabra que siendo justificados por la fe. Romans 5. Romanos 5. We have peace with God. Tenemos paz para con Dios. Through our Lord Jesus Christ. Por medio de nuestro Señor Jesucristo. If today you have never given your heart to Jesus Christ. Si usted nunca ha dado su corazón hoy a Jesucristo. If you publicly have never said Jesus, I need you. Si usted nunca ha dicho en público Jesús te necesito. At the end of this message, you're going to be given the opportunity to do just that. Al fin de este mensaje se le va la oportunidad para hacer esto. And if you will. Y si usted quiere. You're going to receive the wonderful gift of peace with God. Va a recibir el 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 don maravilloso de paz con Dios. Your sins are Given. Sus pecados son perdonados. And you're going to enter into a harmonious relationship. Entonces entra entre en una relación armoniosa. With the God of the universe. Con el Dios del universo. And you're going to benefit from that. Y beneficiarse de esto. And so will he. Y también lo va a hacer. Because él. as you lift up your hands and bless the name of the Lord. Porque mientras que usted levanta sus manos y bendice el nombre del Señor. The Bible calls it a sweet smelling aroma unto His presence. Dice la palabra que eso es un, un of, una ofrenda de olor grato. The Bible says that He rejoices with His people. Dice que él se regocija con su pueblo. That He sings and He dances among the congregation of his saints. Dice que él canta y él danza en toda la congregación de sus God santos. Right here right now in the midst of this congregation es, right there. Dios está aquí ahora mismo en el medio de la congregación aquí mismo. Singing with joy. Y él está cantando Jesus con gozo. Jesus is saying I died for all these people here. Él dice yo morí por toda esa gente aquí. My agony on the cross was worth it. Mi agonía en la cruz valió la pena. The pain, the torture, the pain, all of it was worth it. El dolor, la tortura y, y el Look dolor Look at fue, them here. Valió la pena porque ustedes están aquí. The children God is giving me. Jesus is saying that right now. Los hijos que Dios me dio, Jesús está diciendo ahora mismo. He loves being with us. Él, él, él ama estar con nosotros. Being with us. Él se regocija estar con nosotros. He receives your praises. Él recibe sus alabanzas. Your songs. Sus cánticos. Your shouts of adoration. Sus gritos de adoración. You're bowing down. He benefits from that. Su postal se beneficia de esto. He's not kidding when he says the joy of your Lord. Él no está robiendo cuando dice el gozo de su Señor. God is a God of joy. Él es un Dios de gozo. And he rejoices in you. Y él se regocija en usted. He takes pleasure in you. 
él se, él se think of it, brothers and sisters. Think of it. Piensen acerca de esto, hermanos, hermanas. You can bring joy to the heart of the Creator of all things. Usted puede traer gozo al corazón del creador de todas las cosas. Because we are at peace with Him. Porque nos estamos en paz con él. We are in shalom. We are in estamos harmony with Him. Estamos en shalom, en armonía con él. And He blesses us, and we bless Him. Y él nos bendice a nosotros, nosotros lo bendecimos a él. That is what peace means. Eso es lo que quiere decir la paz. And that's what the Bible is telling us here. Pursue that. Y eso es lo que la Biblia nos dice aquí que sigamos esto. Seek after that. Busquemos Because esto. Because you need to have that. Tenemos que tener esto. To preserve the blessing of the unity of the body of Christ. Para preservar la bendición de la unidad del cuerpo de Cristo. So it isn't enough not to be in strife. Pero no es suficiente no estar en lucha con alguien. It's the call is to be in harmony, in relationship. El llamado es estar en armonía, en relación. It's to reach out beyond your comfort zone. Es alcanzar más allá de, de la zona que está cómodo. It's to go to people who may never have come to you. Es ir a otras personas que tal vez nunca And not to think that they're stuck up or prideful because they haven't come up to you. Y no pensar que son muy orgullosos o demasiado altivos porque no han venido a usted. That love believes all things. Porque ya ley dice que el amor todo lo cree. You don't judge someone. Usted no anda juzgando a alguien. You make it your point every time we get together. Usted lo tiene que hacerlo su su prioridad con ustedes uno. To look beyond your friends. Ir más allá de sus amigos. To sit with different people. Sentarse con diferentes personas. To move around the assembly. Mirar alrededor de la asamblea. To share with different individuals con to diferente. be in harmonious relationship Estar with other brothers and sisters armoniosa con otros hermanos y hermanas. to find a way to share a blessing upon them even if it isn't their birthday or anniversary Aunque no sea su, su cumpleaños aniversario. you buy something and just give it to a fellow sister because just because I love you and guys we can do the same thing y todo, y, y, y we can bring mismo. a gift to one of our brothers something that will bless them I don't know whatever they gave me a ticket to a Mets game I don't go to the Mets game me dieron, me dieron para, para but I receive it because eso. it's a wonderful expression of love Pero lo porque era una expresión maravillosa de amor. that's what we're supposed to do eso que supone que hagamos. after every service we should be reaching out who am I going to invite to lunch today not thinking about how fast we can run out the door to go do our own Thing? No pensando sobre cuán rápido podemos ir a las puertas no, para hacer lo propio, lo, lo nuestro propio. We only see each other for a few hours on a Sunday. Solo nos vemos por unas horas los domingos. And on a Tuesday night for prayer, thank God, y, many more are coming now. Y los 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 martes en de, 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 de oración, gracias es que más, más personas están viniendo. But this is how we preserve shalom. Pero esa es la manera en que preservamos que preservamos el we shalom. We pursue. Lo buscamos. We chase after it. Corremos tras él. Hey, I don't know that brother. I'm going to get to know him. Yo no conozco a ese hermano. Voy a parar Hey, I haven't talked to that sister yet. Sister, to sister. Hermana. Let me go see how she is. Hermana, hermana, voy a ver cómo está. I'm going to break away from my little group here and find other people to sit with. Voy a separarme un poquito de mi grupo aquí. Voy a encontrar otra persona con quien sentarme. You don't have to sit next to your husband and wife every single service. Usted no tiene que sentarse al lado de su cónyuge en cada servicio. You sleep together. Ustedes duermen juntos. I know some of you are going to go, sorry, it's true. Dice algunos se molestan, pero el, you go to verdad. bed together. You get up to, I know some of you don't because of your job schedule. I understand no, that. No, no están por, por trabajo, But so many esto. of you have so much time to see each other's faces every single day. And those who don't, when well, I pray, God opens up a door so you can have more time. Make the, the time. time. However it takes, make time. Make sure your marriage doesn't fall apart. But for the others no who already have plenty of time pero otros tienen bastante tiempo. Please don't insist on being heckle and jekyll with your husband and wife. No, si no insiste en estar. I'm sorry, I don't know how to say no that. No idea, one. estar enlazado de, 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 con el esposo. Tom and Jerry. Even the Spanish people know who Tom and Jerry are. I think. Tom and Jerry, pero se pelean. El gato y el, el gato y el, y, 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 y el jatoncito. Eso se pelean. All right. Break away from your usual little group, people. Even if it's just once a month. And after service, don't be thinking, okay, I have things to do. Yes, you do have things to do. You have to pursue peace. Tiene que perseguir la paz. Which means you don't make plans. Okay, service is over at 12.30. I have to be somewhere at 1. 
Si usted no, no, no si, 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 si puede, no, no, no haga a planes para decir, te, el servicio de mi no, dos y medio, no, 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 Así no es que se hace. That's not how you pursue peace. Así, así no es que usted sigue la paz. Saying goodbye as you walk out the door. Hi, bless you, bless you, bless you. Zoom out the door. Decir bendecir, 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 y se hizo a la puerta. That's not pursuing shalom. Eso no es buscar el shalom. That's just avoiding communication. Eso es evitar comunicación. Avoiding any problems. Evitar cualquier problema. How many people have told me over the gener over the years I've served the Lord? ¿Cuántos me han dicho cuánta gente me dijo después de, a través de los años que he servido al Señor? I don't want any problems. Yo no quiero ningún problema. I get to church, I go right, I pray. After church, I just leave. Voy a la iglesia, oro después del servicio, me voy. I don't want any problems. Yo no quiero ningún problema. Right. You yeah. have no peace. Usted no tiene paz. No amens, I get that one. No amens. <laughs> That's fine. I usually ruffle many feathers with this particular kind yeah, of message. A veces personas con, con este mensaje. But there's a reason why the early church para una, una razón por la que la iglesia primitiva conquered the Roman Empire, friends. conquistó el, el, el imperio romano iglesia. What, what, what really that's, that's usted tal vez no, no entenderá lo que quiere decir eso the es muy grande body of the the world has ever known. el cuerpo de Cristo uh, venció conquistó el mayor imperio conocido you know how they did it? ¿saben cómo lo hicieron? Peace. siguiendo la paz In the Christian congregations. En las en las congregaciones cristianas. If a master and his slave came into the Christian church for their worship service. Si un amo y su siervo vinieron venían a un a un a una iglesia cristiana. And yes, they were masters and slaves in the first century. Y si hubieron entonces amos y y y esclavos en el primer siglo. The minute they walked in. En el momento en que ellos entraban. They were no longer master and slave. Ya no eran amo y y siervo. They were brothers in Christ. Eran hermanos en Cristo. And many times the slave was the pastor. Of his master. Y muchas veces el, ese, ese esclavo era el, el pastor de ese, de ese amo. And the Romans who were outside looked at that and said, "This is this is crazy. What are they doing?" Y los romanos que estaban afuera miraban hacia adentro y dicen, esto, esto es locura. ¿Qué están haciendo?" It was something they had never seen before. Era algo que nunca habían visto antes. And Paul makes it clear when he says, "When you're when you're together." Y Pablo lo hace bien claro cuando dice que ustedes ustedes están juntos. Treat The older men as fathers. Traten a los hombres mayores como padres. Every old man in here, you are a father. Cada cada persona mayor de edad, usted es un padre. And every one of us is called to treat our older men like fathers. Y cada uno de nosotros se nos llama a, a tratar a nuestros ancianos como padres. Because when you come to the church, you no longer have just one father. Pero cuando usted viene a la iglesia, usted ya no tiene solamente un padre. You have a church full of fathers. Tiene una una iglesia llena de padres. Treat the older women, it says, like mothers. Trate a las envejecientes a las como madres. Every family tie we have is superseded. Cada cada vínculo de la familia que tenemos está está sobrepasado. Treat every young man as brothers. Trate cada joven como hermano. Every young woman as sisters. Cada cada joven hermana como hermana. Brethren, I lived this. Yo viví eso, hermanos. When my mother was alive, it was the hardest thing I had to do. Cuando mi, mi madre estaba viva fue lo más difícil que tuve que hacer. Understand, I loved my mother, and those of you who know me know I cared for her to the day she died. Entienden que yo, yo amé a mi mamá y los lo que me conocen saben que yo la 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 la, la quise de que hasta que se murió. And she died in my arms. Murió en mis brazos. And I feel I was blessed to have that experience of seeing her go from my arms into Jesus' arms. Y, y, y siempre sentí de que fue mi bendición de verla de mis brazos a los brazos de Jesús. She was my light, the light of my eyes, my mom. Ella era la luz de mis ojos, mi mamá. I even looked like her. No, a mí, a mí me I ella. do. I look like her. Me, me well, at ella. least on the outside. Por lo menos en, en la parte de But when I first became a pastor, Pero cuando primero me hice pastor, it was lesson one for mom. Le, fue lección número uno para mi mamá. At home, en, ca, en mi casa, call me Reimito all you want. Llámame Reimito todo lo que quieras. And she did. Y, y, lo, y lo hacía. But in church, Pero en la iglesia, I am not your Reimito. Yo no soy tu Reimito. Okay. You don't have any special privileges because you're my mom. No tiene privilegios especiales porque seas mi madre. You're not the first lady of the church. Tú no eres la primera dama de la iglesia. He that will be first, let him become last. The Bible says. Dice que los primeros serán posteros. And she fought it. Oh, she said, "Tú eres mi hijo. I know you are, and I am." You are my son. But in the church, you are my sister. Pero en la iglesia eres mi hermana. Let me absorb the feeling of this. <laughs> You're going, how? No, I did. 
And she would try to, and she tried to challenge that on many occasions. Trató de retar, de, de luchar contra esto en varias ocasiones. So many of you saw some of those occasions. Lo vieron varias ocasiones. When she would take a part and refuse to surrender the microphone. Ella cogía una parte y se rehusaba a dejar el, el micrófono. And she wanted to sing one hymn, it turned to three or four. Cuando ella decía que iba a cantar un himno y se tornaba en tres o cuatro. And I'm oh my God, yo la gota gorda, mami por favor, and mami be, please. I'll be sweaty, mami please. Hey, and somebody once said, "Hermana Talavera, déjame, yo soy la mamá del pastor." You know, one of those numbers. I, I, I'm like, leave oh. me alone. I'm, I'm the mom's pastor. I, I remember, I would go out the back and go in our old building outside and go to the back and stand in the back. En la en la en el otro edificio yo me iba por la parte de atrás y me iba para atrás. Not to embarrass her, you know, and I would say. Y no quería avergonzarla y le hacía así. And then mom would say, "Déjame quieta." La madre decía, "Leave me alone." I'm like, I try not to embarrass her, and she's embarrassing me. Trataba no avergonzarla y me avergonzaba a mí. It was hard for her to grasp the concept. Es fue difícil para ella entender ese concepto. That in church we're all the same, we're all family. De que en la iglesia somos todos iguales y somos todos familia. But I fought hard, and eventually she got the idea. Pero pero peleé bastante y luché por eso y eventualmente. And you would hear, and you would hear, and she's saying, "Ahí está mi pastor, not my son. Ahí está mi pastor." And then and then she would see, decían en la iglesia, "This is my pastor." That's how it was. Así es que era. Then when I got home, pues, Remito, ven acá. And, you know. Y cuando llegaba a la casa, you know, you know, that was another thing. But that's the church. Pero esa es la iglesia. You don't have your sister, your wife, your mother with you here. No, you don't. Usted no tiene su hermana, su hermano. You have your brothers and sisters, period. Usted tiene hermanos, hermanas, punto. And you should make sure that every person here feels welcome. Usted debe asegurarse que cada persona aquí se, se sienta bienvenido. So I challenge you today, glory of Christ. I challenge all of you today. Les reto a ustedes todos, gloria a Cristo, todos. Look where you're sitting right now. Mira dónde está sentado ahora. Look who you're sitting next to right now. Mira al lado de quién está sentado. Is that your usual person? Probably yes. Es esa la persona usual. Probably, I said probably. Posiblemente, probablemente. Many of you, I know exactly where you are because I know where you always sit. Muchos de ustedes saben dónde usted está porque yo sé dónde usted siempre se sienta. I may as well put a name on your seat. There it is. I know where you are. Let's break that, shall we? Rompamos esto. Let's pursue peace together. Sigamos la paz juntos. Let's reach out to one another. Alcancemos los unos a los otros. Let's create relationships with each other. Creamos relaciones los unos con los otros. Let's experience the love of Jesus Christ. Experimentemos el amor de Jesucristo. Let's break through every clique and every group and every little thing we always do. Rompemos cualquier grupito que que estemos decidiendo. I'm going to do it too. Watch me. Yo lo quiero, lo voy a hacer también. Ve, ve I'm going to be sitting among you one of these days. Voy a estar sentado entre ustedes en algunos días de esto. In fact, I did that once. Como yo hice eso una vez. Oh my God, the whole row was like. Y hermano, toda <laughs> la, la, el lado está así. The pastor's there. I'm like, el pastor está aquí. She. <laughs> I, I'm always over here, right? Yo siempre estoy acá. Because I pray, I, I intercede, okay. and, yo oro, and I will continue. Y continuaré. But I'm going to be moving among you too. También me voy a mover entre ustedes también. And going upstairs too, by the way. Y también arriba también. You up there on the balcony, get ready to see me sitting up there with you one of these days. Y en el balcón me voy a ver como sentado con ustedes también. And I'm not, I'm not checking up on you. No estoy mirándolos. Don't think the worst of me. No piensen lo peor de mí. Oh, he's checking on it. No, I'm not. No está, está pendiente. No, no. I'm pursuing peace with you. Estoy buscando la paz con usted. I want to enjoy your company. Quiero gozarme de su compañía. I want to worship next to you. Quiero adorar al lado suyo. I want to feel my voice joining with yours and more going up into the presence of God. Yo quiero sentir mi voz unida a la suya y yo me la presencia. Hallelujah. I want to feel that anointing flowing down. Yo siento la unción fluyendo. On you and on me and the person next to us, person in front of us, person behind us, the love and the power of the anointing of God on the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace. That's what we can have here. You can all have it. Todos podemos tenerlo. But break out, my brothers and sisters. Break out of it. Pero rompe en eso. Change your seating. Change your attitude. Cambia su sentarse y su actitud. Sunday is the Lord's day. El domingo es el día del Señor. More than Mother's Day, more than Father's Day, it's the Lord's day. Más que el día de las madres, el día de los padres es el Señor. Make el plans Señor. with different people before Sunday Haga service. Haga planes con diferentes personas. Call somebody on Saturday night. Hey, what you doing tomorrow? Llame a alguien el, el sábado por la noche. ¿Qué está haciendo mañana? Let's go out to eat after service is over. Make your plans in advance. Vayamos a almorzar después del servicio. Haga sus planes. Not like it is now. We all run around. What's going on? I don't know, don't be crazy. 
We're not the church of the roadrunners here. We're no not. Somos la iglesia de los que corren. No, here, here. Oh, no, no. Aquí Make allá, plans. No, no. Haga tiempo. Pursue. Dice que busquen, persigan con, a propósito. Every time you walk in the door, que look for a new entra face. Entra por esa puerta, busque un rostro nuevo. There's a brother here. Brother Lewis, he's been visiting us now, I think, for about almost three weeks or a month. Lewis, raise your hands. Let me see you, brother. Que hace, que right over there. Tres semanas que nos está visitando. About, about, about three weeks or a month. It's been a while you've been with us here. And it, it, it blessed my heart when I saw one of our brothers just walk in and go right over to him. Hey, how are you? I was like, thank you, corazón, Lord. Yo vi unos hermanos, sí, él, y decir, ¿Cómo está? This is what it means to pursue peace. Eso quiere decir seguir la paz. It's not about you. No se trata de usted. It's not about me. No se trata de mí. It's about Jesus Christ. Se trata de Jesucristo. The things of Jesus Christ. Las cosas de Jesucristo. The joy of Jesus Christ. El gozo de Jesucristo. The fellowship, the intercommunication. La hermandad, la intercomunicación. That's where the glory of God will increase among us too. Ahí, eh, ahí es que la gloria de Dios se va, se va a incrementar entre nosotros. And once that's been done, Una vez que esto ocurra, we can go to the next part of that verse. Ir al próximo, la, 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 la parte de we're pursuing peace. We're in harmony with each other. La paz, en armonía, los unos con los otros. We're forgiving each other. Los unos con los otros. We're dealing with each other. Los unos con los otros. We're blessing each other. Los unos con los otros. We're loving each other no matter Estamos what happens. Los unos a los otros, no lo que we're showing the love that Jesus said would be our identification. In this, by this shall the world know por esto sabrá el mundo that you are my followers que vosotros sois mis seguidores in the love you have for each other el amor que tenéis los unos por los otros and that love is not just some emotional state y ese amor no es un estado emocional that love is action ese amor es acción for God so loved the world porque de tal manera amó Dios al mundo that he gave que dio see love makes you give See, el amor le hace dar. You don't give, you don't love. Usted no, va, no da, usted no ama. I don't have anything to give. Yes, you do. Yo tengo nada que dar. Sí, da lo que sí tiene. If you don't have money, you have you have an embrace to give someone. Si usted no tiene dinero, usted no ha abrazado a alguien. You have the gift of time to give to someone. Tiene el don de tiempo para darle a the alguien. The gift of attention to give to el someone. El don de atención para darle a alguien. To make people feel special. El hacer que la gente se make sienta especial. Make them feel loved. Así que se sientan amados. Cared amoroso. for. Y que se, se sientan that amados. That no one could ever say ever. Que nadie esté aquí diga. I don't have to go because no one's going to notice I'm not there. Yo no tengo que ir porque nadie se da cuenta que no estoy ahí. May we notice. Que sepamos esto. This is a challenge and I can feel some of you saying amen with happy. I can see your faces yo up siento, and downstairs. Yo, yo, este es mi reto y siento que algunos están diciendo amen con sus, con sus rostros. But I, I'm also very conscious of the face of the flesh turning right back at me. Estoy consciente de, la, de los rostros de la carne. Mira. <laughs> Mirando así. More or less something like this. Algo así. Interprete, conmigo no va eso. <laughs> Los intérprete, con eso no va eso. <laughs> que se cree que yo voy a estar aquí. Que yo, que, eh, mm, mm. He thinks I'm going to be doing Vengo that. Vengo el domingo y, eso, y, y que digas que yo voy aquí hoy dos horas. ¿Qué más quiere él? <laughs> I'm here two hours. What, what else does he want? Yo no quiero nada. I don't want anything. Él lo quiere todo. He wants everything. So as I close this, I mean, if you know, I couldn't get past the first slide. No pude, no, no pude pasar el primer, el, el primer este, gráfico. Brethren, there are 20 slides in this presentation. Hay 20 gráficos en el gráfico. Hey, can confirm it. Take a look. There's, a, there's a, like, like 20 of them, if I'm not mistaken. Hay, hay 20 I couldn't get menos. past the first one. Ni siquiera pasé el primero. That's how intense the Holy Spirit is saying this to us. Así es tan intenso que el Espíritu Santo nos está diciendo a nosotros. Seek peace. Seguir la paz. Get out there and meet each other. Love each other. Hang out together. You married people. Don't be so boring. Oh, you don't know. Oh, we're so busy. I know you're busy. I get it. The idea of pursuing carries with it the idea of effort. Older married couples, you should be reaching out to the younger married couples. Parejas casadas que tienen muchos años deberían de alcanzar a parejas que no llevan tanto tiempo de casados. And not just for counseling, for no solo sake. para darle consejería. Go out and hang out. Vayan y pasen tiempo juntos. Be together. Estén juntos. Go to Brisas if you want. Vayan a Brisas si quieren. Go somewhere and sit together in fellowship. Vayan a alguna parte y, 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 y Stop being so boring. Dejen de estar tan aburridos. Our young people are dreading the age when they reach your age. Nuestros jóvenes eh, 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 no quieren ver el tiempo like, que oh, se no, da. Oh my God! Oh, I'm getting oh, old. Oh no. no! But can you blame them? ¿Los puedo culpar? 
When so many couples just come and go and everything is them, them, them. Branch out. I'm not saying every, I'm not saying every day. But make plans. Yo digo, todos los días se Share planes. the wisdom you've gotten with your years of marriage. Comparta la sabiduría que he recibido por sus años de matrimonio. Share de it matrimonio. over dinner. Share it over a nice, una, a nice a juice almuerzo, bar where you're drinking carrot juice and enjoying o tomando jugo, the healthy benefits of a wonderful, o, nutritious lunch. Los beneficios saludables de una, un almuerzo nutritivo. And laughing together and sharing mutual y stories. Y, y and helping other people to grow. A otra que When you get to heaven, God's going to say, What did you do with all that experience you had? Use it. Úselo. So others don't make the same mistakes you did. Para que otros no hagan el mismo error que ustedes hicieron. You can make a difference. Usted puede hacer una diferencia. Those of you who are married, those of you who are not. Aquellos que están casados, ustedes que no están. Share with each other too. También compartan los unos con los otros. How does it feel being single? Eh, what? How are you you're carrying on with your life being single? ¿Cómo ustedes pueden cargar su vida siendo siendo soltero? You don't get together to say I can't wait to get a girlfriend. That's not what you're getting together for. I can't, no wait to, I can't wait to live in a relationship. I have to be in a relationship. No, that's not what you get together for. Usted no se junta para eso. The Bible says in whatever state you're in, therein to be content. Dice la palabra que en el estado que usted esté, esté contento. Content. Contento. If you are married, don't be going around saying, I wish I never had done this. Stop. Si usted está casado, no anda buscando. Ojalá que hubiera hecho esto. Deje eso. Thank God for your spouse. De a Dios por su with all their blemishes and problems, that is the one con flesh to, you are with. And if you're single, bless God for your singleness. Y, y si usted está soltero, a Dios and por enjoy su, it. Por, por estar soltero, y, y enjoy it. Eso, y yes, you can enjoy it. Usted puede de eso. I know I do enjoy. Yo me gozo de eso. And Yo, encourage each other. And don't tell it. And tell each other, don't you dare rush into marriage because you think you're getting old. People need to hear this. Don't be pressured. There is no pressure. The Lord God Almighty is watching over you. He knows what's good for you. He'll fill you. Wait on the Lord. They need to hear this. So encourage each other. Pursue peace. And next week, as the Spirit leads, we'll talk about the second part of that verse. One entire message on one line of one verse. It's off, in case you're wondering, okay? This has been completely unscripted. This is the Spirit of God no right fue, directly here. No fue planeado. here. Espíritu Santo. If you know these things, si usted sabe estas cosas, you are blessed está bendecido if you do them. Si lo Let's hacen. stand, please. Pongámonos de pie. Ha -ha. I, can, I wish I could tell you that, that what, I'm, what I'm feeling in fullness up here right now. The pleasure of the Spirit of God. El placer del Espíritu de Dios. His word came forth for every one of us today. Su palabra vino para cada uno de nosotros hoy. So I'm going to ask us right now in an attitude of prayer. Voy a pedirnos a todos en una actitud de oración. First and foremost. En primer lugar, we invite any friend who's with us today. Invitamos a cualquier amigo que está con nosotros hoy. If you have never said yes to Jesus Christ. Si usted nunca le ha dicho que sí a Jesucristo. Publicly. En público. Today you have the amazing opportunity. Usted hoy tiene la, la oportunidad maravillosa to find peace with God, de encontrar paz con Dios, to find forgiveness of your sins, encontrar el perdón de sus pecados, and to find a relationship with the Creator of the universe that's just for you. Y encontrar una relación con el creador del universo que es simplemente solo para usted. You can leave here today walking hand in hand with God Almighty. Usted puede irse de aquí caminando de mano a mano con el Dios poderoso. Because He loves you so much. Porque le amó tanto. That He brought you here today. Que le trajo aquí hoy. So you could hear. 
hear this word para que usted oiga esta palabra, of how there is a greater reality available to you de que como hay una realidad mayor para usted, a relationship with God through un, Jesus Christ his son una relación con Dios a través de Jesucristo, people su are praying all around this house right now you notice están orando en todo some of them lugar. went on their knees right now some of them are just bowing Algunos their heads it's fine de, de sus están, tienen sus but inclinados. there are people interceding just for you Pero right hay now personas intercediendo solo para usted hoy. so that you will not leave here without peace with God para que usted no sabía hoy sin tener paz con Dios. So as the church prays, mientras que la iglesia ora, if anyone here needs to come to Christ, si alguna persona aquí hoy necesita venir a Cristo, if you've never said Jesus, I need you, si usted nunca ha dicho Jesús te necesito, I'm going to ask you to bow your head where you're standing right now. Voy a, voy a pedir que incline su rostro donde quiera que usted está parado ahora. And to simply say that prayer, Lord Jesus, y, I need you. Y que simplemente haga esa oración, Jesús te necesito. Invite him, come into my heart. Invátelo, invítelo. He's venga standing next to you, waiting for you to say, Come in. If you hear my voice, he says, and you open the door, I will come in, says Jesus Christ. Come to him today. Invite him into your heart, wherever you are. Up on the balcony, here in the sanctuary, watching us on the net, wherever you may be. Invite him in. He will save you. He will wash you in his blood. And, and you will be part of a glorious family. You'll never be alone again. Come to Christ. If that's you today, if you are saying yes to the Lord Jesus Christ, he says to you through his word, if you acknowledge me before people, I will acknowledge you Jesus says he will acknowledge you before the Father who's in heaven so if you are the one who just said yes to Christ or if you're coming back after having fallen away I'm going to ask you to acknowledge publicly that you just made that prayer raise your hand and say that's me I just invited Jesus Christ into my life I just asked the King of Kings to be my Savior and my Lord yeah it has to be public he said so he raised two arms for you on the cross now he says raise one hand and let everybody here know that you choose Jesus today that you receive him as your Savior and your Lord is there anyone who will raise their hand for Jesus Christ today who will say I want to know my sins are forgiven I want to know that I'm going to heaven where are you out there where are you who is God calling here today as the church prays for everyone in this house where is the person that will say yes Jesus I need you and I want the world to know that I want to follow you all the days of my life church please join me in prayer I'm sensing there is a person out there who wants and there's the usual struggle we're dealing with this as we always do I invite you come to Jesus Christ come to the King of Kings surrender your heart to him know the joy of peace with God it's all yours but you must say yes don't turn away from him today he reaches his arms out it's not me standing now it's him reaching his arms out to you saying come to me come and find peace come and find forgiveness and the assurance of heaven today it's all yours if you'll say yes to him we need to proceed in a moment I'm sensing that the door is beginning to close there is someone God is calling someone that's struggling in their heart we need to proceed as soon as the Lord closes the door and the door is beginning to close we will proceed but this is still a chance for you to come to Christ after this day you'll never be able to say again I didn't have a chance yes you did today 
Hoy. This was your day. Este era su día. Today is the day of salvation for you. Hoy es el día de salvación para usted. You either accept it or reject it. The choice is yours. O lo re, o lo rechaza, la, la, But la today es is your day. Pero hoy es su día. I hold the door open a little longer before we close it and proceed. Un poquito más tiempo. Just raise your hand. That's all you have to Levante do to start. Es todo lo que tiene que hacer. I need Jesus in my life. Necesito a Cristo en mi vida. I want him. I need to Yo come to him today. Necesito raise it high. Hoy. And in heaven, Jesus will say, Father, I died for her. I died for him. I have a gentleman over here. I knew there was someone God was reaching out to. Bless you, sir. Bless you. Bless you, sir. Is there anyone else that wants to join him and say, I too want to raise my hand for Jesus Christ? He was courageous. He raised his hand in faith. Will someone join him and say, I too give my heart to the Savior today? I receive peace with God this day through Jesus Christ, our Lord. As the church continues to pray, just, sir, could you please come and let us pray for you today? Could you come stand before this altar and join us, please, if you would? Come and stand right here, if you don't want. Come on up. Just stand right in front of this pulpit, right here, if you would. Over here, right in front. Bless you and thank you. Thank you so much for receiving the call of God through Jesus Christ, our Savior. Bless you, sir. Right there is fine. Just turn this way and face the altar. We're going to pray with you right now. Hallelujah. Church, in an attitude of reverence right now. Sir, I invite you to pray this prayer with me. And say it out loud with all your heart. Dear God. I recognize that I have sinned against you. I'm sorry for my sins. I turn away from my sins. I receive Jesus Christ as my Savior and my Lord. And with the help of the Holy Spirit, I will follow you, Jesus, and serve you all the days of my life. Thank you, Lord. I believe your promise. The blood of Jesus has washed me clean. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you. Father, we pray for this man. He heard your call. He raised his hand and he came forward. In heaven now you are acknowledging him, Lord Jesus, before the Father and before the holy angels. Lord, he is yours. And the church unites to speak pray a special prayer of protection around his mind and his heart that this word that has been received this day will remain in him and bear good fruit 30 60 and 100 fold may it never be taken from him but may he grow in grace and in the knowledge of our lord and savior jesus christ for we ask it father in jesus wonderful name and those who agree will you say amen god bless you we're here at your service This young man has something he wants to give you. Would you please follow him for a moment? He has something he wants you to read. So just come with him. If you were at church, give him a welcome as he comes. Iglesia, dele un aplauso nuevamente. And as he's going to the back, Mientras él va hacia la puerta detrás, would you all do this with me right now? Quisiera que hicieran conmigo algo. I know some people say, hey, we're doing good because pastor said, ah, yeah. whatever. Yeah, right. Sometimes we need a little, a little cast on our arm when it's broken, right? So. No, I'm not going to ask you to pray with each other as we normally do. That's fine. That can happen later. But as we get ready to receive our second offering and receive our children who are going to bring us their program, could I ask you to pursue peace? Amen, Señor Jesús. If you, know what, if you know what that means, please, it isn't say sign a peace, it's go change your seat. It isn't just to say the sign of peace, it's go sit with somebody different for a few minutes. And yeah, kiss them and bless them, that's for sure. Pursue peace with all people, the Bible says. Those in the balcony, join us and do the same. Pursue that peace. Find a brother, find a sister that you normally don't sit next to. Greet them and then sit next to them for the duration of today's service. Come on, move out of that chair. Find what it means to pursue. Pursue. Perseguir. Sigan, levántese, caminen. And then sit together for the rest of the service as we close, as we close in Jesus' name. As Frank comes to counsel, get the second offering. Frank, if you would. Amen, Señor Jesús.
Praise the Lord. Come over here, right there. Right there. Sit over there. Go ahead, John. Johnny. Right there, right there. Sit right there, brother. Go ahead. Have a seat right there. Go ahead. Don't leave him alone. Go ahead, Victor. That's it. There you go. Exactly. <laughs> That's it. So Pastor, I said I'm going to feel alone. There you go. Amen. Amen. Okay, guys in the hallway, please come on inside. This is not time for fellowship. Ushers, please make sure everyone in the hallway comes inside. And once you've had the chance to greet some brethren, take a new seat. Amen, amen, amen. Let's get ready for the children's presentation, please. So come to your seats. Ushers, please ask everyone in the hallway to come inside. Amen, Señor Jesús. Gloria a Dios. Al Santo Jesús. That's it. Come up to the front. Amen, Señor Jesús. Thank you, Lord. Gracias, Señor Jesús. Thank you, Jesus. Gloria a Dios. All righty. So let's take this time to receive our second offering. Vamos a tomar este tiempo para recibir nuestra segunda ofrenda. If you need an envelope, just raise your hand. The ushers are happy to give you one. Si necesito un sobre, por favor, pídale uno a un mujer. We remind everyone that uh, July 13th, we're having a free CPR training. So if you'd like to come on out, you can come on. You can sign up online and come on out. Le estamos recordando que en día, el julio 13 vamos a tener un entrenamiento de CPR. So por favor, tiene que registrarse. Amen. You go to our church website and be able to sign up and be able to come on out and have a... It's, it's free, completely free training. Es un entrenamiento completamente gratis. Tiene que registrarse en el, eh, en el sitio de la web de la, de la iglesia. It's a great opportunity to be... Uh, to invite your family. It's a, a wonderful evangelistic uh, thing to do as well. Y también es una oportunidad bastante grande para que usted invite a toda su familia porque va a ser también un alcance... Neighbors, whoever you'd like to have come out. Y vecinos también van a salir y todo eso. Also, after the amen, también después de que el, después del amén, I'd like to see the ushers upstairs, please, really quickly. Quisiera ver a los sugieres eh, rapidito en la parte alta. So please don't leave after the amen, ushers. Just come straight upstairs. So por favor, no se me vayan, sino que eh, quiero verlos ustedes eh, rapidito en la parte alta. Brothers, also, August 6th, Hermanos, agosto 6, también. we're having our annual domino tournament Tenemos downstairs. El, eh, un tornamento de dominó en la parte de abajo. We have a flyer that we'll put up in the back so that way it's open to everyone. Y está abierto para todos. It actually, it's for everybody, uh, uh, Eric. For everybody, men and women. Ah, Praise es, the Lord. Es para todos, hombres y mujeres. Maybe we should do men versus the women. Oh, no, we're seeking peace. I'm sorry. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no, olvídense de eso. Estábamos buscando paz acá. You see how quick the flesh, you see? Yeah, bring it on. <laughs> Pretty carnal people. Anyway, uh, we're going to pray anyway. Vamos no. It's open to everyone to come on out. We'll have the flyer in the back. You can see Moses for the details. Uh, let's just stand, stand on our feet. Let's raise up our offerings unto God. How many are thankful they can give today? 
I'm going to actually lift it up to the Lord right now. And can you begin to lift up your voice and say, Father, thank you. Thank you that we have to give today, oh God. And listen, even if you don't have anything monetarily to give, you may be going through a financial struggle, no job, something's going on. For you, I'm going to tell you to lift up both hands. And begin to give God thanks also. Not for what you have, but for what you will have. Because our God is good all the time. And you can start to tell him, thank you, God, for the things that are on their way. Father, we just bless you and praise you. Lord our God with our hands in the air Father may you receive from our hands and from our hearts all that we have to give here today my God this morning Father is your day my God and we just thank you Father for being in your presence my Lord may you receive from our hands these offerings these tithes these gifts that we bring Father as we give them into your kingdom Father we seal them with great joy and with blessing and obedience Father giving you thanks and praise for every opportunity we have to give into your kingdom receive it and be glorified for we pray all this in the name of the Father the Son and the Holy Spirit. And everyone said, Amen and Amen. amen Let's give amen. with joy. Vamos a dar con gozo.
By the way, join me in wishing Angel happy birthday today. Amen. And join me in welcoming Olivia, who's been gone from our midst, and she's here today. And it's also a great joy to see Sanaida sitting right there. Sanaida. God bless you. Amen. Please remember. After service today, there is a fundraising auction for the children in the lower level. So please, before you run out the door, run downstairs, okay? Pursue peace for the kids in Jesus' name. Please be seated, brethren, if you would. I want to thank God for our children's department and for the hard work they they, they, they've done to prepare for today. Amen. So I'd like to ask Jackie if you would. Jackie, if you're ready, come on up in Jesus' name. Welcome to Children's Day, everyone. Bienvenidos al Día de los Niños, a todos. When they say it takes an army, it really does. Cuando ellos dicen que se necesita un grupo bastante grande, es así. And this year, I'm so blessed I have lots of help. Y estoy bendecida de que he tenido bastante ayuda. With ideas and making this happen for the children. Con ideas y cosas que han pasado para los so niños. So it didn't matter that they're in different departments, so but they chipped in. So no importa que ellos han estado en diferentes departamentos, pero ellos and nos ayudaron también. And unity we will overcome. Y esa es una unidad que hemos sobrepasado. So please enjoy. Por favor, gocese de esto. The song they're gonna sing and worship God with. Con ese cántico que vamos a adorarle a Dios. Your broken heart is the power. Yeah, God's 
peace on. I sit in here. Bless God for Victor. Bendiciones por Victor. He will be a musician soon. Trust me. He will be a musician muy pronto, Amen. yo creo. Okay, we have a solo part, um, and it's Charlotte who is going to do a praise dance. Tenemos una parte que va a ser este Charlotte. Va a ser una adoración.
Bless the Lord. Aleluya. Bendito sea el nombre del Señor. Aleluya. Thank you, Lord. We're now setting up for a little skit. Ahora vamos a estar It'll be a short skit. Vamos a tener una pequeña presentación. The process, the intention of the skit. La intención de esta pequeña presentación. It's to teach them how God does have a sense of humor. Es de enseñarles cómo Dios He's también merciful. Tiene, tiene un sentido del humor. Es, es misericordioso. And sometimes things that we don't realize we're doing. Y a, a veces cosas que no nos damos cuenta que los que hacemos. People are watching us. Y la gente nos está mirando. So I wanted to show them. Yo quiero que digan enseñarles. That while they're in school. Que cuando ellos están en la escuela. These things could happen. Estas cosas pueden pasar. In their homes, family, friends. It doesn't matter where they are. En cualquier lugar donde estén. But this is something that when they do a skit, they kind of remember forever. Pero cuando ellos ven este tipo de se la My por husband siempre. says I have a fruity brain. <laughs> Mi dice que a veces yo And so I, colors work for me. Y los colores me trabajan a mí. So I, I try to implement some color to liven things up with the children. So trato de implementar estas mismas cosas que me I apologize a mí. for our visitors. I don't have extra t-shirts, but they are part of the children of glory of Christ. Me disculpo con los muchachitos que no tienen And we welcome them camisetas, all the time. pero también pertenecen al grupo de los, de los niños y les damos la bienvenida todo el tiempo. Okay, we're going to ask that they take their parts. Amen. Okay, boys, cell group. Girls, cell group. Greta, is God ready? God is always ready. Geico on that side. niños que han memorizado ciertas partes. Le damos gracias a Dios por la forma como dijo hacerlo. Greta works at a Geico car insurance company. They are having lunch and catching up. Ralph is sitting with one coworker Nicole, and all the others are listening to Greta speak. Time to go home. Let me pick up some pens and writing pads. Good night, everybody. God bless. Greta stops and picks up fruits to take to her small group class. The men's small group is led by Gabriel Sierra, and the women's small group is led by Catherine Sierra. Amen. She's 
do it. Amen. What is the name of Isaac's wife? Her name is Rebecca. Good job. How many, how many kids did they have? Hello. They had two children. What were their names? Their names were Jacob and Esau. Good job. <laughs> Time to go home. Greta leaves her small group class meeting on a Friday night. She is carrying her Bible and her WWJD t-shirt and stops in her living room to pray. Okay, time to hit the prayer closet. Lord, Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thank you so much for a wonderful christ centered day. I have to admit, this little light of mine sure was shining. I felt like I really contributed to tonight's Bible study. What a quiet group. I seem to be the only one talking. Lord, thank you for giving me so much. Thank you for giving me such a willingness to share all the wonderful things you're doing through me. This I'm glad I'm not like the others in our small group. They're so shy and unwilling to share. Hmm, maybe it's because you're not working in their lives as much as you're working in mine. Too bad, oh well, time to move on to, to confession. I don't think I did anything wrong today, but just in case, here it goes. Search me, O oh Lord, and know my heart. Test me and know my anxious thoughts. See if there's any offensive way in me and lead me to the way of everlasting. Lord, is that you? Yes, my child. It is I. You are really okay, Father. <laughs> I've never been able to literally hear your voice before. Well, you have to tell you this is a still small voice. Oh. I said it's just a spring. You can laugh at this. As I recall, Thing. It's been happening for quite some time now. But you really, I'll tell you something. What did I do, Lord? The tree of puppies is quite fast, but the old person of three was born. Moses had ten sabbaths, we have some more. You can take any puppy's puppy and give them to the children of school. But that's not stealing. They expect people at my level to take what they need for personal use. It's a perk. Oh, yeah, that'd be fun. I'm so sorry, Lord. Is there anything else? Why, well, yes, not quite there is. You got some quite a pity too. Even the ladies say that about loud and much. Lord, that is not gossiping. I owed it to my colleagues to warn them about Ralph's little problem. She falls out. <laughs> I mean, 
Okay, Lord. Yes, I will. Love you too, Lord. <laughs> Greta goes to bed and wakes up to pray. She leaves to her office. Her co-workers are murmuring and they smile when she passes them. Good morning, God bless. Ralph, I would like to apologize to you. Really? Yes. It was yesterday I was talking with the coworkers and I know it was wrong of me to to say a false rumor about you. Can you please forgive me? I don't know. What you did was very mean. Yes, I understand, but again, I'm really sorry. Okay. Can you please all come by my desk? I have something important to tell you all. They all look at each other, wondering what she's going to say. <laughs> I want to let everyone know that I told you a false rumor about Ralph yesterday. So I ask you. I, so I ask everyone to forgive me as well. I also need to apologize for taking company supplies as if it was mine, and this is very wrong, and God isn't pleased with me. The co-workers are shocked. Well, what happens overnight? The Lord straightened me out and said I had to fix this because this is very wrong, and it's giving him and his son of general a bad name. Well, everybody, do you forgive her? Let's have a group hug. Everyone, please stand, children. Stop. Guys, these are the 20 class of 2016 of Glory of Christ. Hello. I just want to make a point that I get these children once a month. Yo tengo los niños una vez por mes. It's kind of difficult to help them practice. Y es bastante difícil ayudarlos a practicar. But they did a great job, Pero and I'm very proud of them. Pero hicieron un trabajo y estoy bien orgullosa de ellos, de ellos. And let's pray for the double amount of children we will have in 2017. Y vamos a seguir orando por el doble de niños en el 2017. Pastor, Pastor, they're all yours. Zoe! <laughs> Stay right where you are, every one of you. We have certificates to give you. So we'd like to call your name and we ask you to come and receive it, okay? So, if I can have some help here, whoever can just come and hold these for me. Thank you. 
We're going to promote the following children from preschool to primary. Vamos a promover los siguientes niños desde preescolar hasta primarios. Catherine Sierra. Amen. And Victor Picon. Ah, uh, bless you, puppy. High five. High five. Come here. High five. Ah, he's a case scared. <laughs> God bless you, Vic. Promoting from primaries to intermediates. También para promoverlos desde primaries a Placencio. Are you here? She's not here today. I'm sorry about that. Leah Perez, where are you? Right here. They can see you. Here you go. Congratulations. God bless you, Mama. Promoting from intermediates to juniors. Intermedios a juniors. Aaron Burgos. Angel. Angel Dubanupanki. Damn, come on, brother. Noel Guzman. And Rain Melendez. Rain, are you here today? She's not here today. We'll hold it aside for her. The following have now completed Children's Church. They're growing up. Shailene. Right here? I thought she was here somewhere. She's there. Go get it for her, please. Alyssa. Are you here, Alyssa? I'm not here today. But I know who is here. Gigi. Grace. No longer children. Now they're part of the junior of, of the preteens. God bless you both. Congratulations to both of you. And it's Gigi's birthday today too. Congratulations, baby. Okay, in honor of their willingness to participate. En honor a los que quisieron participar. The following students are recognized. Los siguientes estudiantes son reconocidos. Nicholas Rivera. Angel, where are you, buddy? Where did he go? Oh, here you are. And Miguel Reyes. And Noel Guzman. Noel, God bless you, brother. <laughs> In honor of willingness to help. Elijah Cruz. Eli, where are you? All right, hold that for Eli. Gabriel Collado. Gabriel Collado. Out there today. Catherine Sierra. Kathy, come on up, baby. Come here, come here. Let them, let them see you. Let them see you, baby, right here. God bless you, baby. And Maya Jaquez. Maya, where are you? Oh, there you are. God bless you both. Congratulations to you both. Aha, in honor of his contagious joy and spirit. En honor al, al contagioso espíritu y gozo. Victor Picón. Amen. <laughs> Here you go. Here you go, Vic. Oh, that's okay. Don't worry, pal. Okay, hold on to that. Well, I'll acknowledge her name anyway. In honor of outstanding display of Bible knowledge. El, el conocimiento bastante alto en la, en, la, en la Biblia. Elena, I know she's here somewhere. There she goes. Come on up, baby. <laughs> Elena Rivera. Rain Melendez, who's not here with us today. Gabriel Sierra. Aaron Burgos. Ahmed El Kosiri, he's not with us today, but we acknowledge him as well. And for her exemplary growing faith, Elena Rivera. Wow. For, la fe que que se mas. for your faith, Amen. you're growing in faith. God bless you. And also for exemplary growing faith, Kira Burgos. Beautiful. And also for growing faith, Charlotte. Hold these aside for those who are going to make it today. That's it. And that's it. These are our children. Esos son nuestros niños.
To God be the glory. All right, children. As we close this Children's Day, I'm going to ask you all to come and stand in front of the altar facing me. Come on down. And as is our custom here, can I have the adults please, everyone please stand if you would. And let's come and stand around our children today. We thank God that they're learning the ways of the Lord. And we thank God for the teachers who make it possible. Thank you all. all. How many praise God for our teachers? For every one of you, thank you. Thank you so much. Kids, I want you now to join us in prayer. As we close out, we're going to pray God's blessing on you. Adults, come and surround them, please. And as we close, this is the, this is the petition we're going to present to the Lord. Okay. Vanessa Santiago presents a petition on behalf of Jamil Joseph. Vanessa Santiago está presentando una petición en viaje de este de esta persona. This person received the Lord three months ago here. La persona aceptó el Señor tres meses acá. Unfortunately, he he was arrested Saturday morning. Desafortunadamente fue arrestado el sábado en la mañana. And is seeing the judge today. Y parece que está mirando al al juez el día de hoy. The petition is for the judge to have mercy and release him. Y es una petición para que el juez tenga misericordia y lo puedan sacar. Let's pray for mercy and grace in Jesus' name. Y vamos a orar por por misericordia y gracia. Uh, Sonia Jorge are leaving us for a little vacation. God bless you. Congratulations and Sonia have a safe trip. Ir, eh, bless you. Amen. But every child now, please stand. Cada niño, por favor. Okay. You're learning about how to serve God. Let's do it right. Let's all stand. Stand up. Okay. I want you to close your eyes and bow your heads. As all the adults are going to pray for you. All the, other, all the adults are going to pray for you. And then we're all going to pray for that petition and dismiss in prayer, okay? So everybody now, bow your heads, close your eyes. Congregation, raise your voice and bless these children. May they grow in grace in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. Every head bowed, every eye closed. Let's lift up our voices in prayer. Together, church, let the kids hear you pray. Ishbarra Kutana Morroi Kitarro Bashem Barrokaim Denote Sharroi Kiamaya Tomanam. In the name of Jesus de Nazareth. Glory to you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, we give you thanks and praise for all these. Uh, these are children, Lord God for their presentation here today, Father, for their practices, O oh Lord, for the teachers, my God, who have labored so endlessly, my God, to work with them and prepare all these things we've been able to do here today. Father, we thank you for them, O oh Lord, our God, and we pray your most richest of blessings be upon each and every one of their lives, O oh Lord, my God. We also pray, my Lord God, for Jamil. We pray, Father, that your perfect will would be done, my God, even now, that you would touch the judge's heart to move as you would desire, Father, so that there might be, my God, to the glory of your name, a judgment that is filled with righteousness, truth, and peace as well, my Lord, our God. We also ask, my God, for Sonia and Jorge, my God. May you keep them safe, O oh Lord. May you guide them in their trip, my God. Bring them home safely, my God, but take them and bless them with rest and refreshing, O oh Lord, my King. Father, we pray this over each and every person who is here as well, my God. May you be with us as we leave this place, but not your presence. Father, take us now and complete control in your hands. But Use the pastor this afternoon as he goes to preach, my God, in the church where he's going to visit. And Father, may this afternoon be continually filled with joy, peace, and blessing to the glory and the honor and the praise of your name and so we pray all these things in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit we pray and everyone said amen, amen. greet each other with the love of jesus christ